Hey there folks, how's it going? So now you know how grades work in this course. I know it's a little bit different and it takes some getting used to, but you know what? The most important thing for you to know is that you have to stay on top of your grades. All right, so I wanna be sure you understand how to check your grades in the grades area. I'm on our home page now and I'm in student view. So basically what you're looking at should look pretty much the same as what you see in your course, um, although there may be a different home page now. So I'm gonna go over to the grades area, which is what I want you to do at the start of every new module and click on it. And these are my grades, all right? so. What you see here at the bottom of every assignment is the name of the module. So we just wrapped up the orientation module and I want to be sure that I have completed everything. So if I take a look over here under score, you're always going to see either a check mark or an X or a number. If you don't see anything, it means I haven't graded it yet. So don't be too worried about those, okay? Um, I will get to it as soon as possible. Also, if you've taken a quiz with an open-ended question, then it's actually gonna have um, a line instead of a number because that means I need to grade those questions. Just an FYI. So what you wanna do is just be sure all of this looks right. And you also wanna be sure that you don't have any X's. But if you do, that's okay. What it means is that you missed something in that assignment or you didn't do it at all. And I should have left you some feedback. So you'll see this icon. So if I click on that little icon there, ah, here, it tells me what I need to do. It says this assignment is past due. Currently you have an incomplete. To turn it to a complete, read the assignment page and complete the rubric criteria. Once you have a check mark for this assignment, it will count toward your grade bundle. If you have questions, I need you to reach out, okay? Okay, so in summary, in the grades area, if you see a dash or a straight line, that means not graded yet. If you see a check mark, that means complete, and that assignment counts toward your grade bundle. An assignment marked with an X means incomplete, that means it does not count towards your grade bundle yet. You need to go back, read my feedback, and submit that assignment again until you see a check mark. And for your quiz scores, remember if you see a line for those, it means there's an open-ended question I need to grade. If you see a number, just be sure the number meets the minimum requirement for the grade bundle you selected. And if it doesn't, no worries, you can take that quiz again. So again, do this in every single module and always reach out to me with questions, okay? It's up to you to track your grades and I will give you another tip shortly.